Hi everybody, today we're gonna test the Stiga Art Quad Diamond, new in the market. Are you ready? Let's try! The R Quad Diamond is the bigger brother of the R2. The racket is exactly the same, the compound is exactly the same. The only difference is the shape, which is a teardrop, which means that the sweet spot is also gonna be a little bit higher. Just so you feel the racket, hear the sound. It's a very clean sound. Obviously it's a little bit stiffer than on the R2, but this is also because the sweet spot is a little bit smaller and a little bit higher. In exchange, the acceleration that you're going to be able to create when striking the ball, it's much higher. This means that on shots that you are required some acceleration, like heavy volleys, vibora, some aggressive bandeja, and also ultimately the smash, you will see that the racket travels forward at a much higher speed. And this is going to put a lot more of pressure on your opponents. It requires a higher control, of course, but if you're a good player that plays consistently, this is going to be the perfect racket for you. So what can you expect from the Stiga Art Quad Diamond? The sensations are pretty much the same as on the R2. The difference is, of course, the shape. It's more of a teardrop. It's a little bit more narrow. And this helps the balance to go a little bit higher, which means that for shots that require some acceleration, it's going to be much nicer on the, on the sensations. The sweet spot is going to be a little bit smaller, of course, so that means that you're going to have to need more control every time you strike the ball. If you see that you're a little bit rusty on the sweet spot, no worries, you also have the Stiga R2. But if you're looking to get a little bit more of acceleration on every shot, definitely the R Quad Diamond is going to help you a lot.